first you have your ponies, then you have your stallion. This vehicle is about to be upgraded with a Whipple Stage 2 supercharged engine, 825 horsepower with 640 foot-pounds of torque. That's a lot of room, and it's not even legal to be able to be sold in California, but we have it here. It's also been upgraded with catskin leather, Recaro seats, and it has performance wing as well. It will have that engine installed so you'll have lots of oomph to go wherever you want to go. Six speed manual transmission, rear wheel drive, and it has the Mach 1 handling package as well. It's got the black graphics on the hood with the white accent and many more features. If you'd like to take this beauty out on a test drive, you can book that online at islandford.ca. Stay tuned, we're gonna have a look under the hood and inside and out. And this video will be updated with the newest engine when it arrives. This Mach 1 currently has a 5 liter V8 engine with rear wheel drive and a 6 speed manual transmission. It is soon to be supercharged, stage 2, Whipple supercharged with 825 horsepower, 640 foot pounds of torque. This baby won't even be legal to sell in California. Let's have a look inside storage and speaker in the door, as well as power locks, windows, and mirrors. The driver's seat and passenger seat are manually adjusted, and all seats in this vehicle have been updated to the cat skin leather, and you're seeing this nice diamond pattern. You still have the cutouts, the seat belt minder. It's quite nice. Off to the side, you have a little cubby to put items, your release for your trunk, and your lighting controls. And then when you slide in, on the face of the steering wheel, you've got your iconic pony. We have our volume on the left hand side right is your menu navigation hands-free dialing and your cruise controls over here and this is a push start so my foot's on the brake keys in the pocket and we're going to push the engine start stop button and on the dash any important messages the odometer reading as well we have the menu that we can go through for different options so there was trip one trip two fuel economy tire pressure and then back around again. In the center, we have our display screen. So when I put the vehicle in reverse, we're gonna see our backup camera view. There's the center line, green, yellow, red, how close other vehicles or objects are to us. And then I'm gonna put us back here. We're seeing the map for the navigation. And we also have our audio. We can go into our sources, AM, FM, Sirius satellite radio, as well as Bluetooth. When we go into climate, you're gonna see the dual climate control. That's on either side there for driver and passenger, your AC and your front and rear defrost. Navigation, as I mentioned, you can choose your destination. Then we can go into settings, get your Bluetooth, navigation again, general, so you can change the settings for the distance and temperature and so forth, Fahrenheit, Celsius, whatever you want, whatever language. Display, you can actually dim that out. Get your Ford Pass Connect and you just slide through, touch on what you want, volume and tuner. And there's your dual climate control, your AC, front and rear defrost. So you have it on the screen, but you have it down here. You have the choice to do whatever you'd like. Your fans in the center. There's your engine start stop. You have your hazard lights, traction control, steering wheel feel, and drive mode. So as we toggle through, you're gonna see it appear on the dash normal sport and comfort and then we can go into the drive mode and you see that on the left normal sport and then you have your sport plus track as well you've got gears for your track see the manual we're just gonna press ok and there we go through there so you can customize that which is kind of cool you've got your 12 volt and your USB six speed manual transmission and you've got your cue ball shifter emergency parking brake a couple of cup holders and the rings are the ambient lighting we can open up our armrest and inside lots of room you've got a 12 volt and a usb off to the side is a glove compartment and you have the mach 1 badging along with the serial number auto dimming rear view mirror universal garage door opener and as well you have your lighting controls let's take off 19 inch tarnished aluminum wheels red calipers body colored door handle with intelligent access. That means when the fob's in close proximity, you can lock and unlock the doors. Driver's side, capless, easy fuel gas filler. Got the performance wing in the rear and your backup camera's just above that Mach 1. And then when you're ready to open up the trunk, you can do that from inside, but you can also double click your fob. Releases it for you. And then just put your hand underneath, lift up, and you've got access to the trunk. And then when you wanna close it all up, simply put your hand on the top, pull down, and it's now securely closed. You can lock everything up and walk away or jump in and head out on your latest adventure.
The ride in this Mustang just got better. We've upgraded the seats to cat skin leather. I brought the front seat ahead and you now have access to the two seats in the back. Look at how plush this looks and it'll be super comfortable. It's got a 50-50 split, that's called a fastback, and you now have access to the trunk area just by pulling that tab. Anchors are behind the seat to be able to tether baby seats, and then just give it a push back into the upright position. And then you have the clip on the back, the cutouts, as well as the seat belt minder. LED sequential taillights, performance wing, privacy glass in the back windows, adjustable side view mirrors with blind spot information system, hood graphics, LED headlights, and many more features. If you like this video and would like to see more, please subscribe. We have plenty to share with you and we'd love to hear your comments.